Hi everyone, I'm Kara Sundland. We begin in New Haven where we are learning more now about a hate crime that took place over the weekend just off of the Yale campus. New Haven's police chief addressed this incident this morning. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarlane is live outside of PD headquarters with the very latest at noon. Hi there, Kara. Well, this attack landed the man in a hospital with a broken jaw. New Haven PD, Yale Police, they've been meeting every day this week, exchanging information on this case. Here's what we know right now. According to police, they'll shortly after midnight on Saturday, a Latino man, later identified publicly as Franklin, was walking with his girlfriend and two other friends on York Street in New Haven when a large group of young men allegedly started yelling anti-black and anti-Latino racial slurs at them. We're told the two groups bumped into each other, words were said, and then it got violent with the group beating up the victim until he fell into the street. Police tell us they have video from both Yale University and some video provided by a witness that shows the end of the attack. As for the suspects, New Haven police describe the attackers as two white males belonging to a group of young men that also included some females as well. Police tell us at this point they do not believe the attackers are members of the Yale community. Now police are looking for anyone who might have witnessed the assault or has any information into that early Saturday morning attack. If, if someone had seen like a large group of men, you know, who were rowdy or whatnot, that might be a lead for us. If they, if they saw them get into a car and have a plate for that car or something to that effect. But if someone can identify anybody um, related to that area, 284 York Street, um, please call us. And anyone with information can reach out to the New Haven Police Detective Division. They tell us all calls can remain anonymous. Of course, we'll have more on this story coming up tonight on Eyewitness News starting at 5. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in New Haven. Matt McFarland, Channel 3, Eyewitness News. Okay.